Hello all, this is Steve Belcher with Mid-Cities Vapor. It is Sunday, 8-7-2016 at around 7 o'clock. Which I already said that the first time, sorry. But, Mid-Cities Vapor, as of tomorrow, 8-8 eight, eight, at 10 a.m. We'll be doing business a little bit differently than we have been in the past four years. Please take note to listen to this. There's going to be some changes. We've been telling you guys for the last couple of months. Uh, we've had the video boards up in the uh, store explaining what's going to happen, but I'm going to give you a quick synopsis here of what's going on. First and foremost, 8-8-2016 is FDA prohibition. What that means is there's no more new products, no more new e-liquid flavors, no more changes to any e-liquid flavors. No more adding special this, special that. If we do any of those things, we are considered making a new product. Unfortunately, that's the way that is. And uh, it sucks. I'll be quite honest with you, it sucks a big one. But that's how it is. Last a uh, couple other things is we can no longer period give away any free samples What does this mean to you? It means that if you come in and you want to try a new flavor even though our flavor bar is zero nicotine until uh, until Otherwise stated we're gonna have to charge you To do a flavor or to do flavor. We're gonna actually do it kind of like a buffet I guess you'd say for the lack of a better term we're going to have to charge a dollar when you get that dollar and have to have tax on that dollar so it may do 92 cents and whatever it is it comes up as close as a dollar again and you can try all the flavors you want now if you already know what you want you don't have to worry about it there's no there's no charge it's just we cannot allow you to try anything for free so let's say that you come in and you pay your dollar and you don't want anything then unfortunately we have to keep that dollar. Now, what we're going to do for stuff like that, we're going to give that dollar away to a good cause, either a, 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 an advocacy group or a uh, litigation group that we're a part of. We haven't quite decided that yet, but we're not going to just take that dollar and pocket it. Uh, it's going to go to advocacy. If you do decide to buy something, we're not we're still working on the last minute details, but what it's probably going to end up being is we're going to give you, oh, 90% of the value of that coupon back, somewhere in the neighborhood of 90 to 92 cents worth of a coupon. We can't give you your money back once you buy something because that would be considered giving something away for free. So if you end up buying something, you taste you know, 10 or 12 different liquids and let's say that you have never tried fire and ice and all of a sudden that's the one you really like. You've paid your dollar and you said, no, I want fire and ice. Okay, well that's fine. You'll get fire and ice. Uh, when, we, when you check it out, you will end up having a coupon uh, taken off for that amount. Uh, like I said, I'm not sure of the details of how much that coupon is as long as it's not gonna be 100% of the purchase. Uh, this is not just my store. This is this is stores nationwide. This is how this is supposed to work as of tomorrow. Um, now we may also offer the same thing if you want to do so, because trust me, we need we need uh, funds to fight this. We've got a good court battle starting. Uh, we've got a good litigation team together that is uh, helping fight this industry, helping fight for this industry against the FDA because of these flat out erroneous and unfair regulations that they're putting on us hopefully we can come out ahead on this with some injunctions and or something or changing the predicate date which means that uh, we don't have to worry about something two years down the road which is basically meaning that uh, you would have to uh, well, I'm, I'm gonna be honest with you in two and a half years we'd be out of business everybody would be I mean, I'm not gonna I'm not gonna sugarcoat it it's not it's that's that's just how it is because they're gonna require us to do a pre-market tobacco application which in the for instance for me we did a baseline test based at five hundred thousand dollars per skewer per item it would cost me around six point nine billion dollars and if i had six point nine billion dollars folks i'd be somewhere on the beach uh lastly and the thing that's gonna we're gonna try to make it as positive as possible we cannot touch or modify or help you build anything anymore 
So in other words, if you buy a tank and I say, can you help me screw that on, the coil onto that tank? We cannot. That's considered to be a manufacturer in your lovely FDA's eyes. So what we will do is we'll do the kindergarten version of everything that we do, which is it could be helpful for you guys as well, is we're going to actually grab the same product that you've got in your hand when you got it, when you purchase it, when you buy it and you're ready to use it. And we will walk you through it hand, you know, just like we will we'll say here, this is how you take this off. This is how you fill it. You need to prime it. You do it this way. We'll, we'll show you everything that you can before you walk out the door. It's just that we can't do it for you anymore. And again, like I said, nobody in the United States can do it for you anymore unless the laws are changed. Uh, those are a few of the fun things that we get to do here as of tomorrow. You can help by getting active. Uh, it's real simple. It's not painful. If you if you feel up to it, you can call your congressional leaders, uh, your congressman, Senator Ted Cruz being in our area. It depends on you know, who your district is, on who your uh, congress congressman or congresswoman is. You know, in the in the in the area here, we have. Uh, uh, Kay Granger, and uh, just a little bit up the road uh, north of us, it'd be uh, uh, Burgess, and then a little bit uh, oh, kind of northeast of us would be Kenny Marchant. So those are the three district people in our general vicinity. Very easy to get in contact with them. Go to uh, senate.gov or congress.gov and then type in your zip code. Call them. Okay. Also go look at August8th.com. Now, obviously August 8th is tomorrow, but it will also give you the, uh, the links to sign a petition. This is, this is a, a petition that's held by CASA, which is one of our strongest advocacy organizations when it comes to consumers. So please do that. Something. We want to be in business to help you guys kick the smoking habit. And that's why I've been here. You realize that Mid Cities Vapor is celebrating its four year anniversary in a very, very short few days. Um, we want to be in business for another 40 years. And I want to, you know, would love to. We'd love to keep you guys, have you guys uh, keep coming in like you have been over the past four years. Long tooth as usual. I can't ever do a small one of these. Thank you. We'll work with you if you'll please be patient with us. This is something we have to do. We've tried to be as uh, forthright in preparing for it as possible, but tomorrow's the day. Take care, guys and gals. This is Steve signing off with Mid Cities Vapor. Remember two locations here in North Hershel Hills at the corner of Davis and Harwood. And our not so new location, which celebrated two years off of Camp Bowie and Curzon. Either one of those locations can be more than happy to help your vaping needs and to help you get started or upgrade or whatever you need to do, but we're here to help. Thanks.